Hey guys, I'm Simon Toast Ken, we're about to play a game called The Park! Because it's that time of year again where scariness and spookiness things eases are happening and girls dressing up in their lingerie for costumes. Yes, favorite time of the year. Mm, 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 mm. Love them titties. Got my bear head on, I'm ready. So let's just jump right into it and explore the park. Yeah. Park and nerve experience best play in the dark room wearing headphones. It deals with subject matter that may be disturbing some players during the course of play. Part may manipulate graphics, audio control settings, or sanity. It's perfectly normal. It should not cause any alarm or psychiatry. Okay. <laughs> you shouldn't need any psychiatry after playing this game. Yeah, you know, but hopefully not. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Funcom presents the presence. Heart of mind, I always return to Atlantic Island Park. I need subtitles. Hmm. Smell that... That fart. Oh! Where's oh. Mr. Bear? Mr. Bear? I haven't seen Mr. Bear, Callum. Callum? I'm sorry you have named that. <laughs> Callum? Callum? Ooh, them hiked up pants. Stay in the car. We'll go and ask information. What year is this? So either the 60s or 2015, one of the two. Okay, let's see if I can find some... Aha! Subtitles! Apply! Okay. Alright, uh, Callum. 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 My precious. Uh... I'm just gonna go in... You know, you're... You gotta be uncomfortable sitting like that. You got no... No back support. Ugh. Poor... Poor Cal... Callum! I'll be back, buddy. Don't get kidnapped while I leave you alone in the car. Because, you know, I'm not going to just take you with me like any normal mom that's not trying to find some D by herself. You know, I can't have you holding me back. I can go in here into the bingo place. Is somebody, is it bingo? Yeah, bingo. Yeah, and I park in the back, the very back, really far away, so I can walk all the way over here. And, you know, you're not going to be Callum napped. It's cool. It's cool. Don't even worry about it. Callum was born the day this place opened. This is his favorite place in the world. Oh, how sweet his favorite place in the world. He was born when it was open. It must be for him. Their souls will become one. Am I just supposed to go in here and leave him? Let's go in the bathroom. Knock, knock. Ah, information. Of course. Ooh, cutscene. You got to have his chair real quick. Just say that he was sitting there. What? Huh? What? Oh, oh. Oh, the... Oh, the drugs! Oh, oh that D! I smell the Lorraine. D! Lorraine. Lorraine, you know me? Don't I just... blame yourself, Lorraine. People lose things all the time. Take a deep breath and think about the last place you saw your son's teddy bear. Hey, stop! I think your boy just ran into the park. I'll unlock the gates for you. How, how did you know that I lost... His bear in the first place. Huh? Ah, oh, this doesn't make sense already. Oh well. This is this is go press to shout. Callum, where are you going? Over here. Over here. Hey buddy. Where are you? Wait up there for mommy, Callum. Over here. Over here. It must be up there. Oop, what does that say? Read the flyer. Sure, why not? Wow, Chad the Chipmunk recommends. Stuff! Bingo! Alright, whatever. What is this? Oh, man! Magic! Magical! Nathaniel Winter! Ooh! The escalator zone. The one that goes up. Oh, there he is! Wait hey! Wait there for Mommy, Callum! Yeah, just wait on this escalator for Mommy. It's not gonna, like, you know, take There's you up. something special about the entrance to an amusement park. Yeah? A line drawn between the real world and the world of whimsy within. On this side. The apathy of our everyday lives. And on the other, anything we might dare to No, he disappeared. It's no wonder Callum ran back inside. I wouldn't want to leave either. Well, did you notice that no one else is here? The park is now closed. Oh. Have a safe journey home. Is that light burning out there? The fire at... Whoop! Whoop! This is good! Passing out! <sighs> The drugs! That was nighttime. I've been, I've been riding this thing for a, a long, long time. 
It's cool though. I could have just like, you know, oh man, I'm like laying down on this thing. That's crazy. I could have just walked forward, you know, but no. I had to ride it the whole way freaking up. Because, why oh, not? The park. What happened here? Uh, that's a good question. Wait, Callum. Where are you, buddy? Uh, shift to run. Oh, good. I can just toggle Stop. it. Stop! Callum! Callum! Where you at, little boy? Can't catch me. Watch me catch you! I will catch you! Come on! Well, you're fast! Ooh, don't go in that big creepy face right there! That looks scary! Callum, stay where you are! Come on, buddy! Yeah, I am a terrible mother. You don't even listen to me. You are going to get a spanking. Whoop! Birds. That's gross. Come to mommy, Callum. Come back, buddy. Come on. Wait for mommy. Wait for your mom. What's that noise? Tree, shut up! Is there two? Oh, that's not the moon, that's the light. Callum, you were getting what is this? A bag? You're in so much trouble when I catch you. You were There's a shoe! Callum, you left your shoe! This I'm gonna... belongs to Callum. Hmm. Yeah. No grips in the bottom. No wonder he took them off. He can't run in these. These are these are terrible. Let me put that in my pocket. Alright. Hey squirrel, did you see Callum? Run through here? Chad the chipmunk, huh? Chad the chipmunk. Just a drunk guy in a suit. Oh yeah. Chad the chipmunk, worst in class, can't even seem to pass. Chad is angry, likes to fight. Chad is beaten every night. Chad will have a dead end job. Chad will die a useless slob. Well, I'm. Are you, you going to be chasing me through the game? I hope not. That'd be unfortunate for my titties. All right, let's go in the bathroom. Hello. Okay, fine. I don't need to pee. Squirrel, stay where you are. We got places to be. Like. Mommy needs to see you, Callum. Yeah, I need. To, I need to. This way. I need to talk to you, buddy. About how bad of a little boy you're being right now. You're naughty. Not where did you go in here? Stop, Callum! Where are you? Callum, stay where you are. That way? Wait, Callum. Oh, there he is. He's riding that one. Hey! You can't go in the tunnel of love without your mom. I am your love. You can only love me! Come on, right. mommy! Shut up! You come back! I gotta get in this duck. Oh no! This game's getting scary already. I have to ride a duck. Come on, duck. Callum, where are you? Callum, where are you? Let me ride the duck. Ride swan. Yes. Oh, fade to black. Cool. Well, transition. Hmm. We're on the rails now, boy. I'm at the game's mercy. Can't be stopped. Oh, my feet. Oh, my nice ripped jeans, though. They go up to my freaking neck, but I have a hole in my knee. I, you know, I gotta stay with the trends. Very trendy and stuff. Nothing jump out of the water and get me. Ugh. Shut up. <sighs> Ooh. Spooks down. Ooh. 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 Ugh. Hush. Near a great forest, there lived a poor woodcutter, his wife, and his two children. Yeah? A boy named Hansel. And a girl named Gretel. They yeah. were very poor and had very little to bite or suck. Oh, I thought it'd suck. It's like you don't bite or suck, kids. Sorry, what that was. Don't suck us, the dicks. The woodcutter asked his wife one night. I tell you what, husband, we will take the children into the thickest part of the forest tomorrow and abandon them there. Hello? No, my wife. I cannot do that, said the man. Then we will all starve, you fool. But I like my kitty. Hansel and Gretel overheard their parents talking, and Gretel began to weep. Do not fret, Gretel, Hansel said. He crept out of the hut and gathered white stones from the ground to fill his pockets. Yeah? What's next? Then the witch ate their faces. The next morning, Woodcutter leads the children into the forest. Before they leave, Squirrel? Slice of bread I see you! That they will get no more food I see day. you! What are you doing? Clever Hansel leaves a trail of What are you doing? Behind them as they pass into the woods. No! No! Fuck off! No, we don't want any. Go away! Freaking creepy. Squirrel? I'm listening to the story! Uh, can't even see you anymore. Oh god. 
After receiving no, whatever. From their parents for You're not lost sneaking up on me, are you? Hansel tried to sneak out and collect more white stones, but found that the door was locked. Tomorrow I will take them into the woods myself, the wife told the woodcutter. I'm kind of past the story. I'm going too fast for it. It's behind me now. In the morning, their mother gave them a slice of bread and led them deep into the forest once again. Uh-oh. 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 I'm trooping out, man. Hansel broke his bread into pieces and let the trail of breadcrumbs to leave them safely home. But hungry-eyed birds snatched up the breadcrumbs and his trail was destroyed. Abandoned by their parents and unable to find the trail home, the children wandered in the forest for three days. The children stumbled into a clearing with an exceedingly strange house. Its walls were made of gingerbread, and its windows were panes of clear sugar. Hansel, desperately hungry, ran forward and began to nibble on the walls. Nibble, nibble, little mouse. Who is nibbling at my house? An old woman emerged from the house, sniffing the air and peering around with cloudy eyes. Oh, you dear children, who brought you here? Just come in and stay with me. No harm will come to you. But Hansel and Gretel stayed back, for the old woman reminded them of their cruel mother. Come, children, don't be afraid. I have something for you. The old woman offered them two enormous lollipops. The children took them and began to eat. You see, nothing to fear here. Come inside, the old woman urged, and the children, still licking their sweets, followed. Huh? Ah! What? What? I wasn't falling asleep. You don't gotta hit my boat. Well, I mean, I am. This is freaking boring. But I mean, I guess you're building up suspense. Sweeping and cleaning her hut. Your brother will make a good mouthful. Oh, Willie! Now, <laughs> know what I'm saying? Yeah. Time passed, and poor Hansel refused to eat, fearing the day that the witch would eat him. The witch, for her part, grew impatient. Today, I will cook and eat your brother, Gretel. Climb inside and light the oven. But Gretel pretended not to understand. Uh, I do not know how. Where is the opening? Fool! The old witch said, <laughs> the opening is Push her in, little girl. Yeah. Gretel. Seizing her courage, brave Gretel gave the witch a shove, and the old crone tumbled forward into the oven. Gretel slid a large iron bolt over the door to the oven. Gretel freed her. We're so close to being out, but there's got something's gonna happen here at the end. Beneath the oven. And though she They're cooking the witch right now. Dark story. They cooked a witch. Alive. And then Holy crap, look at their feet! Are their teeth? They that's, up the wow! Witch that's messed up! <laughs> Alright, well, the, the kids are evil. What's that? And where's my kid at, by the way? I don't know where he went, but the freaking creepy squirrel. Duck! Duck! What are you doing? Don't look at me like that! Alright, just, just turn back around. Freaking creepy... Swan? Alright. Let me, uh... Get the heck out of here. Let me off. Let me off. 
Oh man. Leave, please. Oh. Cutscene. Alright, or well not cutscene, but your face looks okay. Callum, Ducky. Why did you go? Where'd you go, buddy? Where's my boy? Follow the trail. Hello. Catch me, mommy. Catch me, mommy. Please, Callum, tell me where you are. This way. Okay. Wait. Stay where you are. Can't catch me. Why you got me so creepy? Callum, where did you go? Hansel and Gretel. I used to read it to Callum when the electricity was shut off. Those poor children. The whole world against them. The forest. The birds. The old witch. Even their own parents. I used to imagine that Callum and I were the kids in that story. Not mother and son, but brother and sister. Hand in hand against the unkind world. Uh -huh. We were always hungry, looking for our own house made of candy, looking for the sweetness that could take the pain away. Hunger leads people to desperate, terrible places where the tree branches reach like claws. Hmm. Doesn't sound good at all. Guess we were Wait for pretty mommy. hungry. <laughs> eh, it's not funny. Ooh. Light? Why you do this, huh? Another accident. This place. This place. It's cool, man. It's cool, right? Hmm. Actually, we'll go pause it right here. I don't know how long this video is going to be. Maybe. Hopefully 15 minutes. Anyway, if today's your birthday, happy birthday. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like or dislike whether you like the video or not. Thank you very much again. I'll see you guys next time. And until then, stay toasty, my friends.